Hi, I just uh, got a new email from uh, Romeo, and uh, Romeo uh, has sent me a pog, and he want to ask if I can help him to uh, fill some hole on the on the pog. Okay, and I will show you so uh, we can learn together. Okay. Okay, this is uh, the park uh, Romeo sent me, and you can see uh, Romeo want to uh, to fill the gap here on the whole area uh, to uh, repair for a surface finish tool pad and this is solid, not a surface. Okay, not a surface model. This is solid. So with this park. Um, I have a simple way to uh, to patch the hole here, so I can show you. <clears throat> you can see we have two hole, one on the right, just a simple hole, and on the left is uh, this hole cut uh, through a few surface. It's uh, more difficult for this one. Uh, it's easy. You can fill it using the create uh, surface, and we can use the available uh, fill hole on master cam. Yes, this simple. If the hole cut uh, cut only one surface, you can use this function. You can click on the surface and move the around to the hole, then click. Yeah, you can see this hole have been patched. Okay, it's quite simple, right? I will try to do the same with this. Oh, so you can see you cannot fill using this function. So I will try to convert to surface, create surface. From solid, okay. Click activate the solid selection. Click on this. I will try if we can use this function to fill the hole again. We create surface fill hole. Click on the surface. Oh, you can see the hole is filled, but uh, the surface had expand, so we don't want it. Okay, and here's the trick for this case. Maybe you can use some uh, surface tool to create a surface to patch this, but I have a simple, very simple way to do it. So you can uh, take it a reference. Okay, this is a solid, so I can use the mo model prep tool of Mastercam. First, I will copy this solid using the dynamic transform. Okay, I'll copy, i make a copy of this solid and put it here. Okay, now what's next? I can click on the motor prep here and I select move function. Okay, now we just need to select the hole here and then we pull it out of the park. In. Okay. If you can enable to move on this direction, try to move it in another direction. In. If it not work, do again. <laughs> yes, trust me. If it not work, do it again. Move. Click on the solid. Okay. And then we move it to the center like this. And move it outside. Yes. <laughs> Very simple, right? Okay, and everything done. We can do the same with this hole. Model prep again. Click on the move button. Select the hole, and then try to move it in a, one direction. If it doesn't move, click escape and do it again in another direction. Move. Okay, click on this. Now we move in to the hole here. It look good, and then we can move it outside of the park. Yes, 
very simple, right? Yeah, because I am do not know much about surface, so this is a very simple way to patch the hole. If you want to keep the hole here and just want to patch, you can do another step by create surface on solid. Okay, solid, solid. And we click on the solid face. Face, okay. Click, click. Uh, this one also. Yes. And then we copy this surface. Dynamic transform. Copy from here to here. Okay. Okay. Done. Very simple, right? Very, very simple. Yeah. This is uh, for lazy guy <laughs> like me. <laughs> yeah. I don't know much. I do not know much about uh, surface. So this is very, very simple way to patch the model. Okay. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.